Hey everyone, I am out here in uh, St. Helens, Oregon today. I'm about to visit a very famous movie house I thought some of you might like to see. If you could see that little sign behind me, it might give you a little hint as to what house I am referring to. <laughs> All right, it's free admission to go see the house. You don't have to make a donation or anything. They only ask one thing, that you park down here and walk up the hill and you'll see why in a little bit. So come along. All right, so right here at the base of the, the hill, there's this little sign asking Twilight visitors to park down here on the main road and walk up the hill to take their photos to avoid issues with traffic. So it's really not that bad. There is the main road, you can see. Lots of traffic, lots of people coming here. And here is the hill that you have to go up to see the house. It's really not that far. It's not that bad of a walk. But as you'll see, it's a dead end up there. And if everybody drives up there, there's nowhere to turn around without getting into people's driveways. So they're just asking that visitors that want to see the Twilight House, just park down here on the main road and walk up. So that's what we're about to do. You see, it's not that far. Here's another sign. All right, so there is the house. Just to give you a little idea. Here is our dead end road. Nowhere to turn around. And here's the rest of the neighborhood up here. So I can see why they're having some issues. So again, if you come, park down on the main road and walk on up. It's kind of like the Goonie House. If you've ever been to the Goonie House in Astoria, Oregon, um, it's a one-way street, kind of a dead end. You have to turn around to get out, and there's a little hill that goes up to the house, and they ask people not to drive up that hill, but people do anyway, and then it's very difficult to turn around. So just park down on the main road if you want to see the Twilight House. So here it is. Bella's house with her dad. That's the front door. We saw them go in and out of so many times. It's really beautiful. Looks very much like it did in the movie. Not much has changed. And it's actually an Airbnb now. Looks like someone's in the window. So if you wanted to stay here, you could actually stay here uh, for the night and sleep in Bella's room. This is the gravel where her daddy parked the car <laughs> when he brought her home in front of the house. So very beautiful house. Definitely worth visiting and visiting and staying in. Okay, well they tricked me. Upon closer examination, that is not someone in the window. <laughs> that is a cardboard cutout. And looky who is up in the upstairs window. I think that is Bella herself peeking out her bedroom window. Now oh, that is kind of cool. I did not see that before. <laughs> Very cool. So again, Twilight Swan House. Welcome, we've been waiting for you. <laughs> 
All right, that's it coming to you from the Twilight Swan House in St. Helens, Oregon. I hope you enjoyed it. Hope you learned a few things and um, see you next time.